The Canisius College men's soccer team is embarking for its final road game of the season, a trip to rival Niagara University. The entire year has led to this 21.4 mile drive up the 190. It's the last such drive that these seniors, the winningest class in school history, will be taking. I'm Jonathan Carey. I'm from Syracuse, New York. I'm number 12 and I'm a senior here at Canisius College. My name is Asani Samuels and we're number 10. I'm from Savannah, Lamar, Jamaica. We've seen a huge amount of development in the seniors. Um, you know, they, they came in and as freshmen were relied on heavily to be you know, main players, uh, playing the majority of time, uh, put into leadership roles very early. Going into this season, um, our goals were definitely to win the MAC championship. And that didn't pan out for us, but I think we've proven that we are a team that can really win any game possible. Our plan was to concede less goals, which we accomplished. We also planned it on making it to the playoffs. Uh, we didn't really accomplish that, but we did okay. You know, players like AC, uh, you know, he is such a better player now, four years later on, than he was when he came in. It's remarkable. Uh, but all of them have matured um, you know, and contributed an unbelievable amount to this program. OK, I'm sure you all saw the results from Marist and Mama, right? I only still have to play the same time as us, right? I want you to put that out of your mind. The only thing we should be focusing on right now is beating Niagara. That's it. All right, the rest of it means nothing at this point. So you can't do anything about it. Right. So don't worry about the results that have gone past. Don't worry about what's going to happen in the other game. Worry about us against Niagara. That's it. Okay? Because we don't want to get to the end of two hours and be on the wrong side of our result and find out that I own a one. Right? So can't control it, just don't think about it, don't worry about it. All we're worried about right now, beating our biggest rival, right? winning the shield, and then seeing what happens with the players. Clear? All right, let's get ourselves together, let's go in the, the main entrance over there. Good boy. Coming into the game with a nine, six, and two record, Canisius needed a win and help to qualify for the conference tournament. Because Siena and Monmouth had won earlier in the afternoon, it would take an Iona loss plus a victory to capitalize on their playoff goal. The team that had already tied the program record for the most wins in a season came into Lewiston looking for their 10th win. I'm going to sign as a teammate. Uh, I, I actually I love him. He's my roommate. and. Uh, Known for four years. For Sonny, it was nice to see it come together in his senior year. Being a part of the All Mac first team and having a chance to be the first person in the school's history to make the All Region first team, well, All Region team three times in a row, is a great accomplishment. I think it's kind of funny because he has a strong accent coming in freshman year, and as, as these four years have gone by, I feel like I'm his, his interpreter. It's kind of interesting. He definitely has matured mentally over the course of his four years, and, and it was great to see him score a lot of goals, get some assists this year, um, and, and have the best season in his career. Um, that was very rewarding for me to see. As a teammate, strong, strong forward. I think he'll be missed. Uh, I, I'd love to see him go further in soccer. I think he can, definitely can. You, when you go out there and you perform, you want to do your best. You want people to see you. And being selected for those teams mean that you did okay, or you, you did well. You know, for people to see, you have to go there and perform. It's not everybody have the opportunity to make a team like this. He's now proven that he's got the potential to play beyond college. Uh, you know, I've had MLS coaches call about him. It's gonna be really hard, but if the opportunity presents itself, I'll take it. Asani Samuels was putting the finishing touches on a season in which he'd earn all region honors for the third time. The senior set career highs with 19 points, 8 goals, and 3 assists. But there was one goal still left for him and the rest of the seniors to accomplish. 
the group that had won 28 games together had yet to beat Niagara. Additionally, their final matchup with the Purple Eagles would be for the inaugural Big Four Shield, a new tradition among the Western New York rivals Canisius, Niagara, St. Bonaventure, and University at Buffalo. As, as up and downs. I mean, we finished with uh, the most wins in the history of the school. Uh, you know, we were 9 6 and 3. We had done to do all out of season. We get into the MAC, anyone can win. Um, it's been like that for the past four years. Once they hit conference, it's all or nothing. It's like a new season for them. Everyone is going there to give their all, everyone is going out there to win. So even the easiest games seems very, very difficult. We finished with, you know, a winning record, um, best record in school history. Uh, you know, but we failed to make the playoffs. Uh, we had a three-game letdown in the middle of the season, which really cost us. Um, you know, and that was very disappointing. Any game's up for grabs, and that's kind of how it always is. And if it goes your way, it goes your way. Sometimes it doesn't. That's the thing, man. The conference is really, really tight. Every point in the conference counts. So going into the last game, I think we could come in between third and come in seventh. We were unfortunate to come in seventh, but overall, we had a good run. We start the bench, go down to the far corner, we'll meet down the far corner. Let's get together as a group. Key for us, first 45, no goals against, okay? Same every game going in, but again, it's one of those, do not give them life. As soon as we score, their heads will go down, their play will drop, okay? So don't give them life, don't let them into the game. So, conservative, bam, Alex, make sure you stay at home a little more early on. All right, till the game settles down and we find a rhythm. All that counts right now is us versus that team, all right? We've got a chance to go to 10 wins, which no other team in Canisius history has done. So that's what counts in the moment right now. A combination of strong defense and missed shots kept the game scoreless through regulation. For the Griffs, a season that saw them set a number of school records, including eight shutouts, only 16 goals allowed, six home wins, and nine wins overall, was about to come down to penalty kicks. It doesn't have to kill it, find a target. Pick a spot, be ready to go. Okay? Come on, boys. Come on. Come on. After the first five kickers for both teams converted, Andrew Coughlin was finally able to keep Niagara out of the net. Chris Berardi stepped up to take his turn for the grips. connected to secure the shield for Canisius. And even though their playoff hopes weren't realized, the Griffs finally got the better of their big four rival. Love Let's go! Let me touch you. 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 Let
Can we get a one, two, three on one? All right, all right, all right. We're on three! One, two, three! Ah! Hey, My experience here was amazing. To think about you going to classes and then after classes you have practice session and then on the weekend you're traveling all the way to sometimes I went to Vegas, we went to California. I went all over America just to play soccer. This senior class has been the foundation for everything. They have set the tone from the start. They have been the um, they have modeled the correct behaviors to each incoming new class. Um, so even though they may not have achieved quite the success that they would have liked, I, I told them in our end of season meeting that that they can take pride in, in the success we're going to have in years, you know, the next couple of years, uh, because they were a massive part of that. The, the soccer program here, I would definitely say, has gotten much better. Obviously, the goal we haven't reached yet is the MAC championship, and I think that's just the next step. Um, I think they'll get there, and I wish them all the best. I wish I could have been the one to help them reach that goal. You have great times, man. Yeah. You have to enjoy it. You have to take into consideration that you only have four years of college and four years of being a student athlete. So, made the most of it. We definitely proved we're, we're a team that, that contends for the MAC championship. You know, next year, we hit the playoffs, we win it, and we just keep building on that success. Well, all I want to say is I'd like to thank Kenesha's College for giving me the opportunity to play here. It changed my life tremendously, and I have to appreciate it. Boys, <laughs> boys, I just want to thank the, the seniors. You guys, amazing class, most winningest class in Kenesha's history, but, you know, I'm lucky we couldn't do it for you. I'm actually saddened that I couldn't do this for you guys. Um, but, yeah, like Rice said, we're a family, even after the season. Here we go, family on three. One, two, three, family! family. It's been a pleasure, boys. It's been a pleasure, Thank you.